Hey everyone and welcome back to another YouTube video on the channel. Today we're going to be doing a nice little camp tour of a little showcase type of thing of this beautiful camp that I made. So this camp is what is what's supposed to be, it's kind of like a clubhouse. So the thoughts were, if you come over here you can have a nice little campity doodah, you can come inside my house. Bloody hell this accent. <laughs> You can have a look around, you can have a look, take a seat, look around, it's beautiful. We've got the lovely meat flag hanging in there. And then inside we've got a nice pool table to keep the fellow travellers entertained. We've got a bar area as well with some nice lighting. It's very nice, I like it a lot. I use the very simple arm shades because you know we're in a bloody nuclear war site and everything's gone. The wasteland's bloody destroyed the lot of us and we ain't got no lamp shades. So yeah, bloody terrible. Over here we've got this bloody amazing view. It's it's just incredible, isn't it? I just love it. This is the, the main point of this entire camp. I noticed there was a beautiful view on top of this mountain top and I thought, you know what, why not? I think I'll do it. And just for extra effects, you know, I thought I'll be the real photographer inside me, the real creator, and I'll take a sit down, get a nice look, never mind enough of that bloody. Too slow, too slow, I know. I'm walking very slowly, trying to make it look very cinematic, and some bloody idiot just destroyed my bloody generator. Let me just quickly repair this real quick. Bloody hell, it's a lot of materials, right. Which little bloody evil can even ugly little things just destroyed that? Oh, you little rippers, come here. Bloody take that, you little sons of the Krakens. I'm refusing to swear here, oh, the bloody hell are you? Get the bloody hell here, my camp sunshine. I'm trying to bloody showcase here. Now bugger off, I'm going inside my camp. Okay, so back again, this is the kitchen bar area. I put some stoves in over there to make it look a little brilliant. Got some nice bar stools, which I was struggling to sit down there because I've hidden my hood to make it look a bit better. Oh, that's very nice of you, thank you. You're really adding to the showcase in here. Looks very nice. So there, here we are, we have our own bloody chef over here. And it's just nice, look at it, boom the thumbs up. Oh, bugger off then, Tara. see you later. Have a look at my vendors. Hopefully you buy something. Please buy something. I could do with the caps. Okay, so. Let's go upstairs. So upstairs we've got this nice, lovely area. I use the see-through flooring because, you know, I just thought we'd, thought we'd be different. Got the display cases up and I added in a lot of different things to try and make this place a bit more realistic. So I've got the cat on the wall. We've got a nice statue. Don't ask me how I lifted it up them bloody stairs. I don't know. And then in the display cases we've got this lovely lovely stuff it's just amazing so we've got the man mask there you can get that for free i've actually got a video on that and then we've got some vintage nuka shine over here because you know it just resembles the inner beauty bloody hell mate will you get at the camera i'm trying to do a bloody tour in my camp here so over here we've got a nice poo sign above the door because that's where the toilet is and that's where you go take a poo and this is the bedroom again we're making use of the lovely view outside with these lovely windows i put in over here and there's a lovely globe there, which was free for a bit. I don't know if it still is, but it was. I think it was a mistake by Bethesda. What the bloody hell do you want? You want to go to the toilet? Go. I don't care. I thought I'd add in a bit of the poo signage for a bit of humour, because I thought it'd be funny. And then inside the toilet, we've got a nice poster on the wall. We've got a nice rug down, some balloons, a plant, and a nice clean bath. And another picture frame above the bath, just to add a little bit of quality. Because, you know, why not? The toilet's falling apart a little bit. I'm a bit of a... I take big poos, you see, and... I don't think any toilets can with, withhold my, my shit. But, okay, down the bottom we go again, and this that's it, basically. It's a nice camp. And then outside, we'll put all the workbenches with using the tire walls, which I really like. I really like the tire walls. I think they're, they're nice. The realistic survivor. I really want to do a big camp build using the walls. If you want to see something like that, let me know in the comments, because I think that'd be really cool. If we can get this video as well, if we can get this video to like 10 likes in the first like 24 hours, I'll, I'll do another one in the next couple of days for definite. If we don't do that though, expect to wait another four weeks because you know the bloody schedule is out the window at the moment. I'm sorry guys, sorry about that. But this is the, I think I think it's quite nice. I think I did an okay job here. Sorry about the horrendous accent. I just, you know, just thought it'd be added a bit fun to the video rather than being a bit boring um, and do my normal voice. So instead you've got to put up with this shitter. But anyway, that's the end of the video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. If you do, I hope you have a nice day. Leave a like for me, because that'll make my day better. And subscribe if you haven't already. Hope you have a great day, and goodbye. See you later.